Hello guys, welcome to the People Bazaar, your one point source for all the Bollywood related news, updates and fresh reviews every Friday. So this Friday is the much awaited film Brahmastra. Yes, the film which has taken Ayan Mukherjee 11 years, the film which has been made at a budget of 400 crores is finally out in the cinemas. So does the film work or not? Yes, it works bang on. Ayan Mukherjee ne ek aisi film di hai jiska intezar I am sure har ek Bollywood fan ko bohat samay se tha. Every time we have seen Avengers, every time we have seen an Avatar, every time we have seen a Titanic, we always felt that Bharat desh mein kahaniyo ki kami nahi hai, talent ki kami nahi hai, then why a cinematic marvel like this is missing? Here is your answer. Brahmas is an answer to all those things. This much like MCU, Mar which is the Marvel Cinematic Universe, Ayan Mukherjee ne ek aisa cinematic universe banaya hai, which is full of special powers, which find their root in the mythology of India, which find their origin from the land of Himalayas, which find their origin in the cosmic powers of all the elements like Jal, Vayu, Thal, Agni and Nandi. So, this is a story of a secret society called Brahmanj. ये ब्रह्मांश के जो मेंबर्स हैं और ये जो ब्रह्मांश सोसाइटी है ये समय समय से बहुत शुरुआत के मे बी ब्रह्मांड की शुरुआत से चलती आ रही है समय समय से ये अपना रूप बदलती जा रही है विद द इवोल्यूशन इन द ईच जनरेशन द सोसाइटी हैज केप्ट इटसेल्फ सीक्रेट एंड इट हैज बीन ट्रूथफुल टू द अल्टीमेट गोल व्हिच इज टेकिंग केयर ऑफ द ब्रह्मास्त्र ईच एंड एवरी मेंबर ऑफ दिस सोसाइटी इज एन अस्त्र इन इटसेल्फ like a Nandi Astra, Vanar Astra, Jali Astra but all of them come together to take care of this ultimate Astra called Brahmastra which is the epitome of energy and if this Brahmastra come together it may be fatal for the world at large. So this is a universe that you have to give a trust in which Ayan Mukherjee has done. So what it starts with giving us this knowledge, then it beautifully takes us to the life of Ranbir Kapoor, who's the hero of this universe. He is Shiva. He's a very happy-go-lucky boy in Bombay. He's a DJ, he likes to dance and everything. But एक कुछ ऐसा आभास है जो शिवा को बार बार होता है जिसके बारे में उसे पता नहीं है देर इज सम लूज कनेक्शन इज ट्राइंग टू फिगर आउट ही सी इज समथिंग एंड ही डजेंट नो वॉट इट इज ही फील्स एट समवेयर इन द वर्ल्ड कुछ ऐसा हो रहा है जो उससे जुड़ा है देर इज अ कॉस्मिक कनेक्शन बट ही डजेंट नो वॉट इट इज ही बिलीव इन लाइट और उसकी जिंदगी की लाइट आती है ईशा से Isha is his love interest. From the very moment they meet each other, there is spark. And from this spark, this energy gets together and they bring us together in this world which is Astra Wars. Beyond this, I will not give away a lot of details about the story because that will become spoiler in that way. But I will tell you reasons why you should go and do watch this film. The first is the storyline. Whenever you are creating a cinematic universe, it is very important that you believe that this can be possible. You believe in the powers of that universe. So whenever in when you are watching a MCU, you believe that Iron Man would be someone who can really save the world from any damage. You really believe that, oh no, Hulk should not get angry or if the Hulk is angry, then this can bring a catastrophe. Likewise, in Astra Wars, we are made to believe that there is a Nandi Astra, which is a Sahasra Nandi Oki power. Hai. There is a Vanar Astra, which can really, really, which reminds of this beautiful vision of Hanuman that we have always grown up on. So the content is very strong. Acting, I would bring, the casting of the film is bang on. So when you see Amitabh Bachchan as a guru, he may not have that long beard. You know, he may not have, he may not look like someone, like a, you know, like a, you know, from someone from Harry Potter. But you see his vision and you feel he's there to take care of Shiva. He's there to guide this Astra Wars and he's, take, he's taking care of all the powers that there are. Naga Arjun works very very well, Ranbir Kapoor, Alia Bhatt, they have just looked their character very well and so is Moni Roy. She is such a revelation. She is the antagonist who is a harm to Astraverse. She is the one everyone is trying to fight with and she looks such mountain of negativity which is the moment she comes on screen there is a chill that runs across the spine what will she do next. 
I would also like to make a special mention of Shah Rukh Khan. Yes, he is there. He is the Vanar Astra and how actually the film starts from him and from there it takes on. So the, the casting of the film very, works very well for the film. But my, something that took my heart away is a VFX. The VFX of the film is never seen before in Indian industry. And my heart fills with pride that this is the brainchild, this is the vision of an Indian director made for Indian audiences, done in Indian languages, as many as six Indian languages by an Indian company. The color pa palette of the film is so bright. Every time this comes on screen, you really believe in the main core of the film, which is the light, which is the goodness of love, which is how love can really, love is the, love can win over all the, all the obstacles. So this works very well. And this gets all enhanced by an amazing background score. The background score doesn't let you lose anywhere. It just, it's so gripping. It is so amazing. The, all the fight sequences are very very well done and the film has the total package in 2 hour 40 minutes is very very well delivered so i really believe that it is an, it has worked very well the only thing i'd like to mention here is bollywood should overcome its fascination for unnecessary songs i think shuruaat ke film mein jo 25 minute hain which also includes the introductory song on ranveer kapoor which is dance ka bhoot could have been done away with. I am a big fan of montage. I think montage works very well. It brings you in, it kind of creates and it keeps you in sync with the film. It is an amazing, amazing, uh, besides that, I think it is an amazing film. Not every day a film like this is made. 4.5 out of 5 stars from my side. Do go and watch the film. Thank you.